Oh no, don't put the tornado there! No! Oh. How's it going, crew? This is Happy Days, and welcome back to our expert super modded Let's Play. And we are here in the temple, smashing up the golem with our awesome new spear mint weapon. Because I had extra lizard power cells, and I'm like, hey, loot is good, guys. We may as well get some more loot. And thanks to everyone who said yes, use the Spear Mint, it is awesome. And as you can see, it is doing a ton of damage, which is very nice indeed. So guys, thanks for the support, as always, almost 2,000 likes on our last Sophie episode. And I say almost because it was like literally 1,980-something, so we were so close. We were so close. <laughs> but I really appreciate the support, guys. Keep it up. You are all amazing people. So I hope you've all been enjoying the Terraria 1.3.2 update. The giveaway winners were announced in the description of yesterday's video. Uh, so if you want to check that out, you can uh, have a look at that. But uh, I am excited because we have a lot going on today. And I've also installed a new mod because we're kind of up to this point. I've installed the Pumpkin mod, which apparently gives some more loot and weapons from the Pumpkin Moon, and I thought, well, hey, we're about at the Pumpkin Moon now, let's give it a go. Does Daedalus Stormbow work in here? Not really. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I would like to fight Pumpkin Moon today. I would like to fight some Fishron uh, and get some of those awesome weapons, because I love Fishron weapons. I love fighting Fishron. It's probably one of my fave bosses, so we've got a lot to do, guys. I have three power cells left, so let's churn through these, open some loot, and get into today's adventure. And that is Golems Complete, people. And I noticed that we have something called an Ancient Essence dropping, which I'm pretty sure I don't know what that is. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure I don't know if that makes any sense to you. But anyway, let's spam open some loot. Uh, I had a few power cells from yesterday, too. And then let's go find out what we can craft. So, you ready? We're going to spam open three, two, one. Woo! <laughs> golem fist, no. Actually, I haven't gotten too many golem fists lately, so that's kind of cool. Ooh, stinger. Actually, that is really good for invasions, and we have invasions coming up now, so what I might do, let's see, I'm going to make another mana star, because a few of you are like, happy, happy, get full mana, what are you doing? All right, so I'll get all this loot back to base. Let's do some crafting. It's a beautiful new day, and we are back at base, and the traveling merchant's here, and I just bought some food off of him, but he doesn't seem to have much else. Uh, but I am excited, guys. Oh, goodness. What? Oh, bubbles. Oh, <laughs> I'm like, what's well, hitting me? I'm sorry. <laughs> um, but I'm excited. I think these ancient essences are from the pumpkin mod. Uh, so let's see what... Whoa, look at all this stuff. Oh, guys. An Unk Blade, 128 damage, machine gun. Oh, look, the Duke's Canron. <gasps> so what is this? I've got these, but I don't have these. Soul of White. Oh, a hammer, an Ice Queen stuff. Oh, summons an Ice Queen to fight for you. Oh, guys, Pump Ferno Scepter, Pumpkin Sickle. Look at the damage. Oh, so I think... Pump Stinger. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Sky Star, Spear On. <gasps> I need all of this stuff now. So, I haven't really checked. I'm pretty sure you get them from Pumpkin Moon, uh, Frost Moon, and maybe Duke Fishron. Uh, I also found two life roots on the way back from the jungle. I decided to leg it. <laughs> um, so, what we might do, I'm going to clear my inventory. I reckon we should fight Duke Fishron yet because expert invasions need stronger weapons. And I think what we've got is not really going to cut it at the moment. I know our spear means strong, but it's not really an invasion weapon. So I'll uh, sort my inventory. Let's get uh, some asphalt from the steampunker. I'll get the uh, blendomatic, and then let's fight a fish run. Oh wow! It started raining. Now before we run away, though, I realised we should really make the beetle set uh, because you know it's good and it's a lot better than turtle. Uh, so I usually prefer the defensive set. Um, just because, you know, your damage is reasonable anyway, and yeah, like, your Beetle Endurance is an amazing buff. So I'll get the arena started, and I'll wait till it stops raining to fight Fishron. <laughs> I love it. How funny is that?
All right, luggage. All right, lizard. We are at the beach. The rain has finally stopped, and we are going to fight ourselves a blue slime. No, we are going to fight ourselves a fish on. So let's put our line in the water and get ready to fight this crazy boss. And no, I'm not going to fight seven at the same time. Although that would be kind of fun. Oh, goodness. So I did a little bit of reforging. I think I got unpleasant on the possessed hatchet, which is... Uh, oh, I should put my buffs on. Which is a nice little boost there. And I got wet. The wet debuff. I don't even know what that does. Um, I guess it might slow you down a bit. Uh, that's That would make sense to me, I suppose. And uh, it feels good to be fighting Fisheron. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Okay. All right. Keep moving. Oh, Slimies, get out of the way. <laughs> um, so we've got our nice... Ooh. Don't enrage him. Don't enrage him. Uh, yeah, we've got our nice Spear Mint weapon. Got our Possessed Hatchet. Also got the Stinger, although that's not really... Oh, okay. It does some nice splash damage, but I think we've got better weapons for the job today. And also got our Daedalus Stormbow, which might be good to use in the last form. Although, to be honest, the Possessed Hatchet does do a very fine job. Oh, goodness, I'm almost dead. Hooray. <laughs> I might use uh, the Spear Mint a bit when I need to sort of keep my distance. Actually, I should try and get some honey, but I can't get near him. And I think he just casted a uh, Sharknado right near the honey, which he seems to do a lot. Um, very sadistic fish. Oh, yeah, I can get underneath. Sweet. Oh, goodness. Okay, where are you? Uh, so he's on 37,000, which means he's getting close to his next form. Um, getting close-ish. So we'll see how we can go. Let's run up the stairs, refresh our bunny. Bunny. Yes, let's refresh our bunny buff. <laughs> what would a bunny buff even do? Make you jump higher, I suppose. <laughs> a flask of bunny? A bottle of bunny. <laughs> oh, goodness. I'm making new potions, guys. <laughs> oh, so I'm not using my uh, blast fire wand. The ma oh, goodness, he's second form. Uh, the main reason is it only does about 47 damage, and Fishron has 40 armor in his second form. So, yeah, it, it would be hitting him for nearly zero. So, yeah, not not the best weapon for that. Um, yeah, the Possessed Hatchet's good. The range feels a little bit short for what I'm trying to do. Although, it is nice when he comes close to you. Uh, you can get some good hits in that way. Oh, and those beetles are saving my life, possibly, because... Yeah, I, I almost died before, and if I didn't have Beetle Endurance on, I probably would have been dead meat, so, yeah, not good. Alright, so we're almost up to last form here. Oh no, don't put the tornado there! No! Oh! So my arena's a little unawkward, because it's got the staircase in the middle of nowhere, uh, which does mean... Ah, uh, the tornadoes are going to be a little bit awkward to dodge, so, you know, we'll do our best, guys. Oh, goodness. Okay, you got a good hit in there. All right, let's get some Spear Mint into him. Yep, 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 good. Okay, okay. Oh, I think he's about to transform. <gasps> no, what's got lightning? No! Uh-oh, last form, last form. Oh, I'm going to throw my heal on now. Uh, yep, 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 okay. Oh, goodness. Oh, okay, I managed to Cthulhu straight into him, uh, which is nice. Oh, I don't have Master Ninja gear. What am I doing? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Whoa, oh my goodness. Oh, no, the platform's slowing me down. Okay, my phylactery went off. How low is he? I can't tell. Oh, goodness, guys. This is going to be a race to the finish. Oh, no, don't you get me, you crazy fish. Oh, no, I touched the wrong side. Oh, no. Oh, I think I got some lucky um uh, Cthulhu dashes into him then. Oh, goodness, this is bad. Whoa! Oh, wow. Okay, okay, come on. Oh, I can't believe how long... Oh, we did it. Oh. oh, enduring. No wonder he was taking so much damage. Crazy fish, Ron. Oh, and we got those new things. Soul of Smite. Nice luggage. I'm glad you approve. Man, that was intense. Holy moly. <laughs> we need stronger weapons. <laughs> Oh, I guess I could have used Daedalus Stormbow, but I don't know. Alright, so I guess for weapons, I'd love the Flareon. The Flareon? Flareon. Yeah, I, I used to call it Flareon. <laughs> the Flareon and maybe Fish on Wings would be good. Alright, you ready? Three, two, one, boom! <gasps> Tsunami's good too. I'm happy with that. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful. What a waste. <laughs> and we got Shimpy Truffle. Yay! Which is one of my favourite mounts in the game. In fact, it probably is my favourite mount, to be honest. Ah, uh, so I want to get some more of these Souls of Smite. So while my buffs are on, uh, I'm actually going to fight three more. But through the power of editing, you just get to see the treasure opening at the end. Let's do it.
Wyvern, get out of here! You crazy Wyvern! No! Wyvern, go away! No! Wyvern, stop it! I'm gonna die! No, Wyvern, no! Oh, oh, okay, I can do this, I can do it! You just gotta believe! Oh, there's fish rods everywhere! Oh, okay, I got Wyvern. Oh no, I stopped moving! Oh man, no! Oh, where is he? Oh man, no, 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 no! Oh, is he low? Is he low yet? Oh no! Oh, Shield of Cthulhu is so slow for this fight. No. Oh. Okay. I think. I think. I think I've stabilized. That was uh, a little bit scary. Just because Wyvern does so much damage too. Um, I think I've almost got him. Oh goodness. Okay. Oh. And yes, that's right. He was volcanic miniature Duke Fishron. Oh. Guys, I just gotta catch my breath for a moment. That was a bit out of control. <laughs> well, the sun has risen and it has started raining again. <laughs> I love when, you know, it's like when you get blood moons a few times in a row or like solar eclipses. It's just crazy, but it is time for treasure, guys. So let's move a few things aside. Oh, goodness, a Nimbus. Ooh, we gonna get a Nimbus rod? Mm, no, bag of potential. Okay, lovely. Alright, so I guess I wouldn't mind anything, but yeah, the flare on or fish on wings would be good. Oh, Raised Blade Typhoon. Three, two, one, boom, boom, boom! Ooh, I got dev set. And I did I get three Razor Blade Typhoons? <gasps> I got fish on wings. Yes, that's so good. Oh good, I've got so much junk. Ah I'll throw away a few potions. I don't need them. Oh, guys, look at all this. Yeah, Razor Blade Typhoons. Uh, so that's actually pretty nice. That's going to be useful uh, for the invasions coming up. Um, we've got 28 of these Soul of Plight things, which is cool. Smite, sorry. Um, so I guess let's get back to base and do some crafting. Well, let's see what we can make with our Souls of Smite. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, a Pumpkin Soul. Oh, you can summon a Pumpkin's Horseman. That sounds like a boss, but we need more souls for that. So I can make a Triton Blade, a Spear on, and you make it at a Lizard Altar. I'm going to have to go back to the temple. <laughs> oh, that actually looks pretty good. Souls of Twilight. Oh, you can actually upgrade the souls. Oh, man, this is huge. And we can make the Duke's Canron. Okay, so I need to take 18 Souls of Essence thingos. Uh, should we make all three? Yeah, I guess so. All right, so I need to take 24 Ancient Essences to the temple. All right, let's go. We've made it back to the temple, and now we can do some crafting. Oh, guys, here they are. The new weapons. The Duke's Canron. Let's just make them all. Canron, sorry. Uh, the Spearon. Oh, and the Triton Blade. Oh, I'm so excited. All right, let's put them in our hotbar, uh, and then we can truly see what they do. So, number four. Oh, it makes a tornado. Oh, no, that is so cool. Oh, no, I love this. Oh, okay, let's try the spear on. Oh, goodness. Is it, is it throwing? I can't see the uh, projectile. I think this one might be damaged. Oh, anyway, the Triton Blade is working, guys. Oh, so look, if we're going to summon the Pumpkin Moon, we're going to have to make our way to the dungeon and get some ectoplasm. Let's do it. Well, we've made it to the dungeon, and we have our amazing new tiny Triton Blade. <laughs> I need to modify this. Um, and I'll do some research, guys, and see... Oh, wow, this weapon is so amazing. Oh, can you imagine this for Pumpkin Moon? Oh, and we got the Kraken! Oh, no way, that's so cool! Oh, can you imagine how good this weapon's going to be for Pumpkin Moon? Like, you literally just cast it in the middle of where all the mobs spawn. Oh, sniper! No! 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 And I've got, I've got the Staggered buff! No! Or debuff, rather. Oh, no! Run! Oh, goodness. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> oh. Anyway, we'll leave that there for today, guys. Oh, if you know much about the... Oh, no, it's another sniper! If you know much about the Pumpkin mod, let me know in the comments below. Uh, leave a like if you're enjoying... Oh, Dark Matter, too. Oh, it's another sniper! Oh, goodness. Uh, yeah, if you know much about this mod, let me know in the comments. Uh, but here's the most important part, as always. You all stay happy, and I'll see you soon. This is Happy Day. He's about to die and signing out. See ya.